Hey DIYers, Jimmy here with Jimmy's Plumbing Solutions and today I'm going to be demonstrating how to clear a toilet using a toilet auger. Okay guys, so having a plunger is a must in every household but I also think that it's important to have a toilet auger because a toilet auger can get to a can bring up a solid uh, way better than a plunger can and uh, it can save you a couple hundred dollars. So let's jump right into it. This one right here for every homeowner, a person out there with a plumbing issue. You wanna do it yourself? JPS, where to go? When that toilet don't flush right or that sink cloud, Jimmy's Plumbing Solutions gonna help you fix it all. With 10 years in the game in this plumbing trade, he don't wanna ask for help. I know that's why you came. Hook up that kitchen faucet with step by step plumbing knowledge. Do it yourself, cause it can save you a couple dollars. For minor issues, every homeowner yet to see. JPS can say today we solving problems easily. No need to fear a couple pipes and some standing water. Just watch the video here and we can get it in order. Come ask a question, leave a comment, like and subscribe. If plumbing tips are what you need, that's what he supply. Okay, so what you're gonna need to get this job done is a uh, toilet auger, six feet. You can get this at Home Depot. And a bag, a trash bag to put it in once you're done because it's going to be dirty and uh, have some water dripping on it. And a towel that you do not mind getting dirty. Okay guys, so you're going to get your towel. You're going to just set it up on the side of the toilet. Closer to it. You're going to get your auger. Lay it down. And you're going to want to come all the way out to where this is hitting the orange all the way out. That's so. And you're going to want to be careful because that metal could scratch your porcelain. So you're going to want to make sure you get that elbow inside the toilet. That's so. So once it's in, you're going to want to push in as far as you can go. So once you're as far as you can go, you're going to have to try to clear the peak track by spinning or rotating. That's it. And you just keep on going until you're all the way in. You give it a few turns, clear out the line, and you should be good. So after that, you're going to want to just pull it out. Be careful, nice and slow. Okay, once it's all the way out, be careful not to scratch the porcelain. You're going to excess water, shook it in the bowl, set it on your towel. Okay guys, uh, it's that easy, so if you have any questions or comment, don't hesitate to drop it in the comment section below, and um, I'll see you on the next one. Until then, happy plumbing. You know how to take a picture, right? No, I'm just recording. No, you can take a picture. <laughs> I don't know how.